Hi everyone, welcome to day 42. We're in the book of Psalms and it's an interesting one. I want to encourage you that as you go through this chapter, don't rush through them if you've been rushing through. Please take your time and soak in every verse because there's some serious juice. During times when we pray at night, you know, and God stirs up this books of Psalms, you see how one verse can become a whole encyclopedia. You know how God just opens them up and all of that. Um, the space of time that which we're going to be teaching does not give room for me to go all explicit. So I don't really want to stir up all those teaching, teaching things as we go through Psalms. So I'm just going to allow the verses themselves speak. And we will come in the night prayer and the Lord stirs up anything. We will flow in that because we have time to do that. But I just want to read to you Psalm 46. And let the Holy Ghost breathe life to you as you listen or rather open up your bible and let's read some 46 together god i will be personalizing it so you to personalize it with your sense of my me i and all of that let's go god is my refuge and strength always ready to help in times of trouble i will not fear when earthquake comes and the mountains crumble into the sea let the oceans roar and foam let the mountains tremble as the waters surge. A river brings joy to this city of our God. I am the sacred home of the Most High. God dwells in this city. It cannot be destroyed. From the very break of day, God protects this city called Princess. The nations are in chaos and their kingdoms crumble, but God's voice thunders and the earth melts. The Lord of heaven's armies is here among us. The God of Israel is my fortress. Come, see the glorious works of the Lord. See how he brings destruction upon the world. He causes wars to end throughout the earth. He breaks the bow and snaps the spear. He burns the shields with fire. Princess, be still and know that I am God. I will be honored by every nation. I will be honored throughout the world. The Lord of heaven's armies, the Lord of hosts is here among us. The God of Israel is my fortress. Father, we thank you because you have proclaimed again that we are your city. And we thank you for your bubbling river of life that stirs itself within us and causes us to experience the stillness that only your river can give and the joy that only your river can give. In the name of Jesus Christ, we receive the supply of joy and stillness from the river of life today. Thank you, Father, because we advance in victory knowing that you are our fortification. To so Lord, our fortress, we bow our hearts in adoration. Thank you, Lord. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Heal the freshness. I'll see you tomorrow.